15 10 it's a warm-up match before we go in on to the hardest chess site in the world where we are just practicing our stuff getting into the mix let's put an x-ray through to the queen let's get this bishop out let's bait a pawn So it is longer play, got plenty of time, can take the night. Let's get comfy. Let's castle. it can sense that we're going here takes take one higher piece so they have to take take back it's no great shakes but it's something crikey sake let's attack the knight let's take because we're on higher piece like we said and take. That was a waste, wasn't it? I could have actually taken his rook. I was so motor set with my move. <laughs> so bad. Uh, they've resigned anyway. That was a silly game. Don't get motor set. I mean, he's probably done a mouse slip. Maybe we're supposed to take, but he's actually mouse slipped. <laughs> so take time. I've got to really learn to just take time and don't do the preemptive. Oh, silly, silly, silly. Lessons learned. Okay, another 15-10. Can't go out like that with that silly game. So I'll bring the knight up, supporting the pawn. Let's push the pawn like we do, supporting the pawn. If they do take, they have. Let's take the bishop. Let's take the pawn. Let's bring the bishop here, defending the pawn. Let's get the knight up, just blocking the queen. Let's bring the bishop here, defending, also getting ready to castle. They're looking a bit urgent, so I think we need to be just taking stuff off the board. Queen's looking, maybe not. Shall we castle? Does capture, let's capture. Mindful of the pawn here, disrupting the pawn structure with a check on the king. Doesn't take again. That's very silly, isn't it? So we could grab, but we are opening up space for the rook to come down. Do we want to take them chances? Should we attack the queen? Paul takes the bishop, queen takes it. No, he's got support. Paul comes down, attacks the bishop. Just bring it all the way back then. It's attacking the pawn through here. Let's attack this pawn. Looking to squeeze in on the queen. Okay, let's squeeze in on the queen. to keep the diagonal no and bishop does have a check on the king but yeah okay i think we could do that couldn't we checks first and all if we chase the queen away the queen's going to come around here and probably attack this pawn change the same get this rook here facing this pawn but the rook will put a check on the king anyway so let's bring the queen here If it's dancing, if it's a dancer and it's attacking, Rook can put a check on. No, he's not dancing. 
Let's bring the bishop back. Shall we double? Rook can come and protect, but it's only one piece protecting. Oh, the damn pawn. So if we can get this bishop out of the way, maybe attacking the pawn, but then he drops down. So let's do this. And maybe try and get here. But I don't know if we're going to be fast enough. He's going to probably do that to try and hit our bishop. Going to hit the pawn anyway still, because we'll get both rooks off the board if the pawn does take. Rooks defended, pawn can take. Pawn takes. That square bishop can attack the rook, but this pawn can still... Let's take, it's probably taken with the rook, isn't it? Nope, taken with the pawn. So Coming here, the pawn drops. We're trying to give this bishop some strength. We go there, the pawn drops. Maybe this is not the best position. Maybe coming here, x ray through to the king. Give it something to do. And they've resigned. Okay, if that was a better game, I think I'm going to do another one. Doesn't look like this player's playing. Not going to get much practice from that, am I? Let's crack on, crack on. I think I need to do a shorter game, don't I? These, these guys are blobbing. Let's do a shorter game. Let's go for a 10. That's what we'll be doing on the hardest chess site in the world, 10. So let's go for it. Oh, this is not good. Yeah, the waiting ages. Let's do another one. Last one. This is the last chance to lose now. 10 minute zero increment game. How can I go into the hardest chess site in the world with this type of warm up? Come on. Let's grab here. Let's bring the bishop out. Knight. Moving a bit quick, and I think they've made a mistake. Yeah, I think something's gone wrong, but can I capitalize on it? I want to see if I can show you.
You're good for a draw. Looks like, oh, I can't really squeeze in. I don't think, I can't push here. Ideally, I want my queen to be here, but I'm not going to get that time because it's just going to take the pawn here. And it's not just going to be lazy enough to... I mean, I suppose I can take a pawn back here. But then he's taking more pawns off. Then I'm taking this pawn. They're not going to be asleep enough to let me take the rook off the board. I think we're going to go for a draw, aren't we? Unless, of course, he brings his rook here and blocks, and then that puts the kibosh on that. No, it's not doing that, so I'll click the thing. Yeah, that's a draw. Um, I'll just have a quick look at the analysis. It's probably saying, no, it's not a draw, dude. So we have to go back a few moves. One, two, two, two. Two, two, two. Oh, it's showing it's a draw. Fair enough. I won't lose any sleep over that one. Okay, on another 10 and 0. Hopefully this will be the last one. I mean, last one was a was half decent draw. I couldn't really see any way through. Let's see if this game's going to kick off. We've got another slow starter. What is wrong with this um, site today? Well, I know it is a 10 minute game, but crikey, they're dragging the heels a bit. So hitting the pawn in the center, see whether or not there's going to be any captures. Only reason why I panic when they take so long with the moves is that I don't know whether or not they're just going to not make a move forever and a day and they're just going to let the time run out. So that's the most annoying thing. That's, that's why I get a little bit um, antsy. It's not because I want them to play quickly. I just want them to make sure that they're going to make a move. So we could take... Wait, what is wrong with that then? So we take, they take, we take, queen takes... Queen comes here protecting the pawn, or rather the bishop does. Do we like that look? Or do we just attack the knight? I think we're just going to take... It's too complicated, dancing all over the place. And we're going to take... Just bring the bishop out, like we said. Queen's not got a direct attack. King feels like it's going to be very lonely if we castle on this side here. So I'm going to bring the queen across now. Maybe there's a queen exchange going off. Or they're going to get a little bit arty bringing the knight through. I think they're getting a bit arty because they've, they've stopped now. So yeah, they've gone arty. Let's take the pawn. Got the x-ray through to the king. So bishop can take. He gets the pawn back with the knight. So I don't really know why they're taking so long over the moves. Like I said, I'm not wanting them to do blitz or bullet or anything. It's just making sure that they actually are going to make a move. Oh, nice touch. But let's just, um, small piece attacking a higher piece. Can't be wrong. We still have the X-ray through. If they castle, we just take the queen off the ball for free. So attacking. So we can take the queen off the ball for free with a check on their king. That's getting a little bit too arty there, dude. So the king has to move, so we need to get castled. There might be method in the madness, you never know. They've got bishops got out coming out all over the place. So I think the king's moving here so that this rook can come here. Or oh, it don't really matter, does it? It can come there, and then the rooks come here. So we have to move there. We have to castle either way, so we're not going to get time to win the bishop. And this is one of those moments again where 
don't know why it's taking so long to make a move um, because really it's, it's a f direct threat on the king. So you either move the king from one side to the other or bring something back to support it. It doesn't seem to be rocket science. I mean, this bishop is under attack, so you're probably thinking that they'll bring the bishop back to um, defend and keep the bishop safe because the queen is not going to take. We have to go and castle. But I think the king is going to come here right, rather than to the side. And they've left the game. Unbelievable. What a shabby shower of warm-up matches I'm playing today. How can I go into the strongest site in the world with these types of warm-up matches? This is not good. I might even have to go into a blitz match or something to get warmed up more. This is shocking. Come on. No way made I'm going into the strongest site in the world with that shower of games. Let's go here. Let's grab. And I don't really like this setup, do I? Going to attack the pawn. I don't like this opening, this pattern stuff that is going to transpire. It's got my pawn. Okay, we'll have to give the bishop up. Maybe come here. Knight's jumping here. I don't. I definitely don't like this this pattern stuff. Now he's going to take the pawn off the board. We don't have anything. Bishop could come here, just to support, because it was targeting this pawn, but it's not going to carry much weight, is it? Okay, let's just do simple. Just do simple. We don't like the position. Let's see if we can improve it. at them just wanting to take stuff off the board let's castle it's doubled up there's no gaps here at the minute so we've got two bishops so in essence we really want to be opening spaces up don't want to be jamming anything down a bit of a bad bishop here so now we gets to open up so we take, opens up with a check on our king. So we don't have to take. There's no rule saying that we have to take. We could attack the pawn here at the side. Let's attack the pawn here. There's nothing protecting it. Obviously, this is going to attack. Obviously, that's going to be moving out of the way. Oh, the king goes and defends. So, is there something that the rooks can do? Come on, lazy rooks. Where's he going with this knight? Move the king out of the way. Let's move the king out of the way. Keep it simple. I think we're probably still going to take anyway. He's going to open up. But his king's blocking his other rook for a few moments. Maybe we can get a trade. Although, I think now... Oh, they're not going to do for that. Okay, let's go for the trade while we've got the... It's probably just going to go here. Can't go there because he's just going to drop. But then we can take this anyway if he does move there. All right, so let's get ready to double. This knight's going to be happy blocking, isn't it? Yeah, we might have wasted our energy going there now. He's not doing it just yet, but let's see. I think he's just going to block here. So then we'll have to take here. Come on. That looks nice. It 
It's a check and get in the pawn. I don't like getting trapped. It's a check and get in the pawn, but I might not greedy munch the pawn. Maybe swing this here. Hit the knight, maybe. I don't know if that's going to work. Rook comes here, get a check on. I think we must try it. Oh, does he go here and he's blocking that area? Oh. You know, it's so annoying when you see it after you've done your move. So tunnel vision done. So he goes there, he's blocking this movement. Yeah. X-ray through with the bishop. That's annoying. Take with a check. And there's nothing much really is the check, 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 check. So it looks like another draw. Wow, how many draws am I getting? Check. Check. If he goes back here, check. He might run out of spaces, might he? But I don't think he's he's just gonna go side side, isn't he? Side side. I don't think there's a magical position. Could take. Ooh, that might hurt. Oof, hold on. Attack. Take. King takes. King comes here. And we've got a pass pawn anyway. All right, maybe, I'm not sure. No, what was I thinking? Goes there, rook comes here. Rook goes there. We attack, then he comes here. And then we get checkmate. Woohoo, okay, let's see if that works. Although I think he's a little bit too clever. Uh, he's not going for that, but see if they get the rook off past pawn. Well, I think it's probably going to go there. Oh, uh, do we take? Is this past pawn going to help us win or not? Do we think? So get the rook off the board. No, he's coming over for it. Look how fast he's coming over for it. Jeez. Right, he can't come round here, but he can get this pawn, so my king can't go up and down like that. Oh. So if we go one, so he has to go up and down to come and get it. But I can't really follow him, can I? Because I go here, then he goes across, and I support, well, he goes across, I'm not, ugh. has he just circumvented himself now then? Because now we can run. I think he should have been going down here, shouldn't he? So now I think we can just bring the king here and push this pawn up. That was lucky. I, th I think their weight was... I'm going to look at the analysis afterwards. Their weight was on getting their king around here. Although we did have our king that was going to come around here. Let's grab. Let's push. Let's push. Don't think we need to worry about that pawn. Let's push. Push. Get the queen. He's got my pawn some. Oh, my queen can come and get the pawn here. Push. 
put the check protect the pawn. Capture, we can move down. Move the king. He's got space to move. He's got all the space to move. Let's go. Should be a resignation really now. Okay, that was a better warm up, warm up type thing. It's not finished yet, obviously. Let's go here. Okay, that was a bit better. Quick look at the analysis for this end game. And it's showing that it's plus 10.4 for us. So that's way over the plus seven mark. So I was thinking, well, okay, if they get across here, then they're going to be able to come and block the pawn or take the pawn off the board. But if they did that, um, I think we would be, they would be in trouble, really. So the king comes down and defends. So my thinking was if they did do this, we would be able to do this. And if they did come across, then our king could come here. If they did decide to go down, then it's not really going to bode too well for them, is it?